talking about the chico. <laughs> no, chico, her tail also is like even on these faces, it's like black, white, black, white, black, white. Well, everyone else has like different patterns on their tail. Oh. And so that's a good sound, that's chirping. When we first got them, <laughs> oh, and yeah, we yeah, when we first got them, that's all we heard. It was growling and hissing growling. and spitting and, you know, I'm going to come over. <laughs> but um, the first time we heard the chirping, we were like, oh my god, we're good people now, yay, yeah. we finally made the transition. Yeah. So it was kind of, it was different to get used to these guys, because, you know, some people go in with their cheetahs, some people don't, you know, obviously we work with the lions too, but the lions, I mean, obviously we're not going to go in with them, you know, right. so even though we have so many years working with the lions, you know, it's different, you know, it's so different, different kind yeah. of cat, yeah, yeah, and so these guys also have a different mentality, I mean, they're not going to go up and kill you, you know, these guys are going to put on a big fight and turn around. Are they all sisters? Oh, funny. Yeah, there's three. Yeah, yeah, these guys are all sisters, and then you know the the boys are brothers, but they're like different litters. I mean, yeah, they're not related at all. Yeah. Were the boys born in captivity? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, and the girls were too. Yeah, Cincinnati. No, Which one is this? That is Jira. Hi, Jira. And just like any cat, like we have a two-person rule, you know, when we go in with the boys, and we also watch their behavior too, you know. Like maybe Kuzo, just like Kuzo, because you know he's a little more reserved. You know, if he doesn't want you near you, then that's fine. I'm not gonna get near you, you know. <laughs> so yeah, they're retired now. We're not gonna, you know, put a collar and leash on them and kind of walking around. You know, they're just living the big life in Indy. <laughs> oh, that is so cute. Just like giant house cats. I know, yeah. A little more uh, and even, like, even if when you see the lions up close, same thing, like any behavior you see you do your cat at home, like the lions will do, you know, which is just amazing. Yeah. And see, if they were upset with us, they would like leave us and like, you know, go to as far away as they can. And they're just sitting right there, you know? That's awesome. They might growl at you, but they're not leaving. <laughs> well, that's good. They're standing their ground, so. Trust me, I'm not getting anywhere near you. <laughs> Yeah, so the girls get two and a half pounds per day of raw meat, and they also get, um, you know, how those big tenderloins that you could buy at the grocery store and you kind of chop them up a little bit? Oh, they get one of those, too. <laughs> wow. Yeah, and then the boys, they get horse meat that comes from Canada, and um, they get uh, chicken, and so we use the chicken for our cats. 